On this tray, we have a knee joint and a kidney. But what in the world do these two have in common with each other? Well, when we did a previous video on the arthritis of this knee, and just in case you missed that video, you can see some gouges taken out of the cartilage there, and even right there, pretty much bone on bone. But when we did that video, it caused people to wonder about other joint conditions, one of those being gout. Now, gout is a buildup of urate crystals within the joints. And when those urate crystals build up within the joints, it can cause a gout flare and can cause immense pain. Now, the knee joint can be affected by a gout flare, but the most commonly affected joint is the big toe, specifically this joint right here called the metatarsophalangeal joint because it's between the metatarsal and the phalange. But what do the kidneys have to do with this? Well, remember urate. All of our bodies produce urate, but people with gout will have hyperuricemia most often, which is too much urate in the blood. And it's the job of the kidneys to excrete that. Now, sometimes people with gout will have both too much of the urate, and for whatever reason, their kidneys aren't excreting it as quickly.